creations. They do not walk amongst the living, killing mortals for pleasure. Oh, you don't think dreams can die? Hi and welcome to Select 10. We're back with another best new web series video, and in order to provide you with the greatest recommendation, we've tried to enhance our suggestions and selected the current top 10 best new web series from various genres. We only included the finest web series with the highest IMDb rating, so watch the entire video to avoid missing any of the series on the list. Now let's start the video. Number 10. Blood and Treasure. It is an action-adventure series created by Matthew Federman and Steven Skaya. The story follows Lexi, an art thief, and Danny, a smart antique specialist, as they work together to catch a deadly terrorist who finances his operations with looted artifacts. While Lexi Viziri is a cunning art collector who is troubled by the terrible death of her father, Danny McNamara is a retired agent who specializes in stolen art and treasures. When a cunning terrorist kidnaps Danny's mentor, Dr. Anna Castillo, and flees with a precious artifact, Danny enlists Lexi's assistance to find the criminal and save Anna. As they travel around the globe in search of their target, Danny and Lexi find themselves in the middle of a 2,000-year-old fight over the cradle of human civilization. Overall, the story is a brilliant blend of history and fiction, and lost treasure from history means mysteries, and this show is packed with plenty of mysteries to amaze any history fan. You will enjoy this show if you like Indiana Jones movies and treasure hunting. And the show has a 6.6 .6 rating on IMDb and an 85% audience score on Rotten Tomatoes. Number 9. The Resort. It is a dark comedy mystery series created by Sam Esmail and Andy Ciara. The plot centers on a married couple, Noah and Emma, who are celebrating their 10th anniversary by taking a trip to the Mayan Riviera, while Emma thinks that their marriage isn't progressing, Noah has been pleased with his life. However, a couple's anniversary vacation tests their marriage when they become involved in one of the resort's strangest unsolved mysteries from 15 years earlier, which involved the missing of two young people, a death, and a once-in-a-century storm. In general, the series progresses like any good suspense thriller, it makes you wonder, and it is entertaining, but the one drawback is that, the storyline becomes disorganized, starting with the fourth episode, which throws us off track. That being said, if you enjoy the White Lotus series, you might enjoy this one as well, because their stories are similar. The show has a 6.9 rating on IMDb and an 86% critic score on Rotten Tomatoes. Number 8. Reservation Dogs. The second season of this underrated teen series has arrived, starting on August 3, 2022. If you are new to this show, let me give you a little description so that you can begin watching it. It is a teen comedy drama created by Sterling Harjo and Taika Waititi. The plot revolves around four Native American teens from remote Oklahoma who loot, kidnap, and save money in order to travel to the exotic and remote country of California. But in order to succeed, they will need to collect enough cash, outwit the drug dealers at the cemetery on the outskirts of town, and fight a turf battle with a much more dangerous local gang. To begin with, this is not your typical teen show, it is a unique teen series that introduces us to a strangely familiar and humorous universe. The story is outstanding and packed with plenty of humor, emotion, and it has all the ingredients to keep you interested and is a must-watch teen series. Believe me, you do not want to miss this one. And the show has an 8 rating on IMDb, and the second season has a 71% audience score on Rotten Tomatoes. Number 7. Uncoupled. It is a romantic comedy series created by Darren Starr and Jeffrey Richman. The plot revolves around Michael, whose life appears to be flawless, he has a terrific career as a real estate agent, a loving family, good friends, and a long-lasting romance with Colin. But when Colin abruptly ends their relationship and moves out on the eve of his 50th birthday, his world is turned upside down. Overnight, Michael is forced to face two nightmares, divorcing the person he believed to be his soulmate and finding himself in New York City as a lonely gay man in his mid-40s. Later in the series, after being unexpectedly dumped by his long-term spouse, Michael examines life as a newly single man, navigating the dating scene for the first time in 17 years. Overall, it's an extremely enjoyable, lighthearted, and joyful series that won't let you get bored for even a second. And the show has a 7 rating on IMDb and a 77% audience score on Rotten Tomatoes. Number 6. Paper Girls. It is a science fiction series based on the comic book series of the same name. 
The show centers on four young girls who, while out distributing newspapers the day after Halloween in 1988, unknowingly get involved in a fight among rival time-traveling groups, which leads them on a journey back in time that will hopefully protect the Earth. As they journey through time, they meet future iterations of themselves and must decide whether to accept or refuse their destiny. I know what you're thinking, and yes, similarities with Stranger Things and Dark are undeniable, with bike riding youths and the never-ending problems of time travel giving us huge flashbacks. Yes, the show isn't perfect, but it has a fresh idea and solid sci-fi aspects that make it worth watching. And the show has a 7.2 rating on IMDb and an 84% audience score on Rotten Tomatoes. Number 5. Alchemy of Souls. It is a South Korean fantasy series, directed by Park Joon-hwa. The show takes place in a mythical country named Diho, which doesn't exist in the past or on maps, and it is about the passion and evolution of young wizards as they face their strange destinies owing to a magic trick known as Alchemy of Souls, which permits souls to transfer bodies. The main plot revolves around a skilled warrior named Naksu, whose soul gets mistakenly imprisoned inside the skinny body of Mu Diok, who is jang -uk's servant. Jang Uk, on the other hand, is a member of the noble Jang family and has a horrific childhood mystery that is widely known throughout the nation. However, when he meets Mu Diok, an exceptional warrior soul stuck in a small and weak body, she assists him in returning to the right path in life while also discreetly teaching him how to fight. Overall, it is a top-notch fantasy drama with incredible comedy, mind-blowing action, and unpredictable twists and turns. In essence, it is a complete entertainment package and the show has an 8.6 rating on IMDb. Number 4. Pretty Little Liars, Original Sin. It is a slasher horror series created by Roberto Aguirre Sacasa and Lindsay Calhoun Bring. It is the fourth TV series in the Pretty Little Liars franchise, which is based on the novel series of the same name. The events of the show take place 20 years after a sequence of horrific events that nearly tore the blue-collar village of Millwood apart. The main story follows a group of dissimilar young girls, a brand new set of little liars, who are haunted by an unknown assailant, holding them accountable for something terrible that occurred in the past and forcing them to pay for the wrongdoing their parents did 20 years ago, as well as their own. Overall, it is a kind of show that keeps you on the edge of your seat, and the story is decent, but if you enjoy horror and slasher films, this one is a must-see. The show has a 6.9 rating on IMDb and an 81% audience score on Rotten Tomatoes. Number 3. Trying. It is a British comedy series created by Andy Walton. The show centers on Nikki and Jason, a couple who sincerely desire to have children but have difficulty conceiving. However, later in hopes of having the baby they desire, they choose to adopt, only to confront a number of unexpected problems and difficulties that occur with the adoption process. Ironically, all Nikki and Jason want is a child, but with their unstable friendships, messed up family, and hectic lives, will the couple be capable of convincing the adoption committee that they are suitable parents? I won't give you a spoiler though. Trying is strangely accurate in certain aspects, and despite its seriousness, it is actually entertaining and one of the best comedy shows on TV. If you enjoy comedies and heartwarming stories, give this one a try, you won't be disappointed. Also the third season premiered on July 22, 2022, and has a 100% audience score on Rotten Tomatoes. And the show has a 7.8 rating on IMDb. Number 2. Dark Winds. It is a psychological thriller series based on the Leaphorn and Chi novels by Tony Hillerman. The show is set in the 1970s and covers the federal investigation into a bank heist in Gallup, New Mexico, as well as the Navajo tribe investigation into the deaths of two Native Americans in the area. The major plot revolves around Lt. Joel Leaphorn, his rookie officer, Jim Chi, and Sergeant Bernadette Manuelito, who are in charge of patrolling the area in Monument Valley. However, during the murder investigation, the peculiar activities of some of the citizens and strangers mix with their own lives as the two police officers fight the powers of darkness and their own emotional problems on the journey to redemption. Dark Winds as a whole offers a fantastic balance to its plot and successfully blends a solid murder mystery with indigenous cultures and struggles. So, if you're looking for a different kind of crime drama, Dark Winds is not to be missed. And the show has a 7.7 .7 rating on IMDb and an 84% audience score on Rotten Tomatoes. Number 1. The Sandman. Finally, one of 2022's most anticipated fantasy shows has arrived, and it lives up to the hype. 
Don't worry, I'm not going to give any spoilers, so sit back and enjoy this short review. The plot centers on Morpheus, the king of dreams, and one of the seven endless, who was taken prisoner in an occult ceremony in 1916. When a sorcerer tries to catch death in order to deal for a mortal life, he accidentally captures her younger brother, Dream. However, Dream escapes after being held in captivity for 105 years, and he must travel across multiple worlds and realities to repair the damage his absence has done. It is a tale that travels across time and space, introducing us to magical kingdoms and otherworldly realms. Overall, the series combines mind-blowing visuals with a brilliant story, making it one of the best fantasy shows you'll see this year. The show has an 8.3 rating on IMDb and an 88% audience score on Rotten Tomatoes. That's it for today, thank you for watching this video. And do subscribe our channel to see more videos related to movies and series suggestions.